Hi, I'm Ted. Today I'm going to show you how to divide an Excel spreadsheet. This is something that's very useful to know how to do when you have a spreadsheet that, that's very big, that has a lot of rows and columns where you can't see it all on the screen at the, at the same time, and you might want to see a column over, way over to the right at the same time seeing the column on the left or the top row while seeing uh, the rows further down. So I have this spreadsheet. It's a very big spreadsheet uh, that I found that has a lot of information on all the members of the Baseball Hall of Fame. And let's just scroll around a little and I'll show you the problem that, that, this, that you, you encounter quite often. I'm going to start scrolling down and you'll see very quickly I can't see the top row. The top row is the, is the headers. I want to always be able to see that. So there's two, and, and then if we scroll left and right, we can see all the information, but we can't see the most important thing, which is the player's name over here on the left. So there's a couple of different ways to do it. I'll show you first the way I prefer, and then another way that a lot of people prefer. What we want to do is we want to find a menu item that's called Freeze Panes. So on this computer, this is a Macintosh, it's under the Windows menu, you can see Freeze Panes. I think on the uh, Windows operating system, it's under the View menu. So you just want to find that. But before you do that, you want to click on the, the row just below the one that you want to be the header row. Then you go up to the Windows menu, Freeze Pane, and you can see um, there actually is a, is a solid line that was created just under that. And now when we scroll down, you'll see that top row always shows. Now we, I'm just going to undo that, and I'm going to show you how you can do the same thing with not only the top row, but also the left-hand column. And that is to go into the spreadsheet and click on the cell just below the row that you want to fix and just to the right of the column you want to fix. So we click on cell B2, go up to Windows, Freeze Panes, and now when we scroll left and right, we always see the left-hand column. When we scroll up and down, we always see the top row. So I hope this has been helpful. I'm Ted, and today I showed you how to divide an Excel spreadsheet. Thank you for watching.